A heartbreaking scene on the Manning River, the home of young Tyree couple Josh Edge and Sarah Soares floating towards the Martin Bridge. Their belongings, cars and pet dog were washed away with it and to top it all off, they were supposed to get married today. Oh my God. A shock for locals a as the property drifted the further down river. A donations website quickly set up to help the couple get back on their feet. Nearby, residents were rescued by the SES as countless homes in the region went underwater. They responded to about 1,000 calls for help on the central and mid-north coast. We had a surge of requests for assistance yesterday and last night with people um, having to evacuate on their roofs. The river has made it to our front yard. As waters surged at Telegraph Point, locals didn't have time to wait for emergency services, rescuing an injured man. Surf lifesavers have been called in to help from up and down the coastline, rescuing stranded residents as well as these council workers who'd been stuck in their trucks for 30 hours. We need to get out to Wingham to those that are desperately in need with the rising flood water. Evacuation orders are in place for almost 20 towns between Kempsey and Bullard Dealer. Our house is completely inundated with water. It's up to your knees inside our house. <laughs> I'm extremely upset. I'm trying not to be teary. Um, very, very distressing. The SES going door to door. Evacuation centres open up at West Kempsey at the showgrounds yeah. if you like to evacuate. I think I, I might stay. OK. At Maxville, they made the best of it. In Nambucca, the rain isn't letting up, causing chaos for residents. The cliff behind us gave way, the, the mountain's gone, uh, it's all come down in a mudslide. Countless roads are cut off, including the M1 at Taree. It's about 1.2 metres under at the moment and it's going to get worse, it's going to keep rising. The rainfall's been immense and record breaking. At Kendall, near Port Macquarie, a massive 405 millimetres was recorded. Here in Tyree, the hospital is on the other side of the Manning River and completely cut off. The next closest major hospital is in Newcastle, almost a two-hour drive away. One of the many reasons authorities want people to stay safe inside. But not everyone is heeding the calls. Trapped drivers rescued by boat, also in need of rescue, livestock. People rallying together to save a cow on Old Bar Beach.